Ebola virus. Ebola virus causes acute hemorrhagic fever, which is manifested by high fever, severe weakness, and symptoms associated with bleeding from various organs. The Ebola virus usually spreads through contact with blood, body fluids, and tissues of infected animals or humans. This virus was first detected in 1976 in the Ebola rivers, which gave it its name. The Ebola virus is several strains, some of them cause more severe symptoms than others. Mortality from the Ebola virus can be very high, reaching 50 to 90% in various epidemics. Treatment is limited to maintenance therapy, so as rehydration and symptom relief, as there is no specific treatment or vaccine. Preventive measures are included in the control of infection, including the use of protective equipment and isolation of infected patients. HIV, HIV, human immunodeficiency virus, causes AIDS, acquired immunodeficiency syndrome, which affects the human immune system, making the body more vulnerable to infections and tumors. HIV viruses are divided into two types, HIV-1 and HIV-2. AIDS develops when HIV destroys the immune system so much that the body becomes unable to effectively fight infections and tumors. This can lead to serious complications, such as opportunistic infections and cancer. HIV AIDS treatment includes antiretroviral therapy, ART, which inhibits the reproduction of the virus, preventing the progression of the disease. Prevention includes the use of condoms, clean needles, and injection syringes, as well as HIV testing and receiving those infected with the virus for treatment. Influenza virus. Influenza virus is a virus that causes an acute respiratory disease known as influenza. It belongs to the orthomyxovirus family and has several subtypes, including influenza A, B, and C viruses. Influenza A and B viruses usually cause serious epidemics and pandemics, while the influenza C virus causes less severe forms of the disease. Influenza is transmitted through drops released when an infected person coughs or sneezes, as well as through contact with contaminated surfaces. Flu symptoms include fever, headache, weakness, muscle pain, cough, sore throat, and fatigue. Some people may experience serious complications, such as pneumonia, which can lead to death. Influenza prevention includes vaccination, frequent hand washing, avoidance of contact with sick people, and the use of masks during periods of high flu activity. Influenza treatment includes rest, hydration, anti-influenza drugs, and symptomatic therapy to relieve symptoms. Lassivirus. Lassivirus is a virus that causes Lassa fever, a disease that is transmitted through rats and leads to acute hemorrhagic fever in humans. It belongs to the arena virus family and is usually found in West Africa. The Lassa virus is transmitted to Ruma through air or through contact with rats or their secretions. The main sources of infection include the use of contaminated food or water, as well as contact with rats at home or in the field. Symptoms A of Lassa fever include high fever, headache, pain in muscles, throat, and abdomen, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, and sometimes bleeding from the gums and other organs. In some cases, acute renal failure, encephalitis, and death may occur. Crimea Congo. The Crimea Congo virus, also known as the Crimean hemorrhagic fever virus, belongs to the Bunya viridae family. It is transmitted to humans through tick bites, as well as contact with blood or tissues of infected animals or humans. The Crimea Congo virus is found in various regions of the world, including countries in Africa, Europe, and Asia. The main reservoirs of the virus are also animals such as cattle and sheep. A person can become infected by treating infected animals or ticks, as well as by contact with the blood or tissues of infected animals or humans. Treatment of hemorrhagic fever caused by the Crimea Congo virus includes symptomatic therapy to relieve symptoms, hydration, and maintenance of organ function. Prevention includes avoiding tick bites, using protective clothing, and regularly testing and treating animals for the virus. EEC Eastern Ecuvalencephalitis, EEC virus, is a virus that causes acute brain inflammation known as encephalitis. It is transmitted to humans through the bites of infected ticks, 
mainly living in forest and suburban areas. After a tick bite, the incubation period can vary from several days to two weeks. Symptoms include fever, headache, nausea, vomiting, stomach disorders, cramps, and impaired consciousness. In severe cases, paralysis and death can occur. Treatment of viral inflammation of the brain caused by VCE includes symptomatic therapy to relieve symptoms and maintain organ function. Prevention includes the use of an anti-tick repellent, wearing protective clothing, and avoiding staying in wooded or suburban areas during periods of tick activity. The yellow fever. The yellow fever virus belongs to the Flaviviridae family and is a causative agent of yellow fever, an acute viral infection transmitted through the bites of insects, mainly mosquitoes. The disease can manifest itself in a mild form, with symptoms similar to influenza, or in a severe form, with pronounced symptoms such as fever, yellowness of the skin and sclera, bleeding from the gums and mucous membranes, as well as liver and kidney disorders. In severe cases, gastrointestinal and genitourinary bleeding may develop, which can lead to death. This virus is common in tropical and subtropical regions of Africa and South America, where it can cause epidemics with high mortality. The main reservoirs of the virus include monkeys and certain types of mosquitoes. Treatment of yellow fever includes symptomatic therapy to relieve symptoms and maintain organ function. Prevention includes vaccination before traveling to endemic areas. The use of mosquito repellents and the wearing of protective clothing. Nipah virus. Nipah virus is a virus that causes a disease known as Nipah fever or Nipah virus infection. It belongs to the Paramyxoviridae family and is one of the main causative agents of viral cephalitis in humans. The virus is transmitted through contact with infected fruit bats. YDI serve as the main reservoirs. Possible transmission routes include the use of contaminated juices or fruit products, contact with the urine or feces of infected animals, as well as through inhalation of aerosols containing the virus. Symptoms of Nipah fever can range from mild flu-like symptoms to severe encephalitis with seizures, paralysis, and coma. Mortality from the disease can reach 70%. Treatment of Nipah fever includes maintenance therapy to relieve symptoms and maintain organ functions. Prevention includes monitoring of hygiene and food hygiene, as well as providing information on the risks of infection. Zika virus. Zika virus is a virus that is transmitted through the bites of infected mosquitoes, mainly through Aedes mosquitoes, such as Aedes aegypti and Aedes albopictus. The virus can also be transmitted vertically from a pregnant woman to a fetus during pregnancy, causing birth defects. Infection with the Zika virus can be asymptomatic or manifest as mild symptoms, such as influenza, such as fever, rashes, joint and muscle pain, conjunctivitis, and fatigue. However, some people may have CNESAR. Three shave complications, such as birth defects in newborns, such as microcephaly, as well as Guillain-Barre syndrome, and inflammation of the brain in adults. The Zika virus was first discovered in 1947 in the forests of Uganda. Since then, it has been recorded in various countries, mainly in tropical and subtropical regions. The Zika virus became the subject of international attention after the outbreak of the virus in South and Central America in 2015 to 2016. Treatment of those infected with the Zika virus is limited to symptomatic therapy to relieve symptoms. Prevention includes the use of mosquito repellents wearing protective clothing, and avoiding mosquito bites in endemic areas. It is especially important for pregnant women to avoid traveling to these regions. The Marburg virus. The Marburg virus is a virus that leads to acute hemorrhagic fever, similar to the Ebola virus. It also belongs to the Filoviridae family, as well as the Ebola virus. The Marburg S virus was first detected in 1967 in Marburg, Germany. In cases of acute hemorrhagic disease in medical professionals involved in the treatment of green monkey tissue samples. Symptoms included fever, headache, muscle pain, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, and internal and external bleeding. In severe cases, acute renal failure, hypovolemic shock, and organ failure may develop, which can lead to death. Treatment of the Marburg virus 
is limited to symptomatic therapy to relieve symptoms and maintain organs. Prevention includes hygiene control, the use of protective equipment when working with infected materials, and isolation of infected patients. Yes, yes, yes. I'm the guy from the video. Thank you very much for watching. I will be glad if you like and leave a comment on what topic you want to talk about in the next video. Also, don't forget to watch our other videos. See you again.